In this tutorial we will look at some curve editing tools. So let's go ahead and start by drawing a curve. I'll just select over here and um, that was a one degree curve. So if I right click and I want a smooth curve I can change that to a three degree curve. Okay and let's do one more. Alright so I have these three curves and I can start to use them and edit um, with them. So the first thing I can do is extend. Let's say I want to extend that curve into this curve. I can select this curve first, type in extend, and then you select the curve to extend and it will extend that curve until it intersects the other curve. Another useful command is trim. So I can select two curves, type in trim, enter, and then I can trim that object so that it trims it where those two curves intersect. Um, you can also do things like fill it. So let's say I want to fill it uh, this curve right here. Um, it's going to fill it based on the units you have set up. So if I go to tools options, I can change my units um, under units. And right now I have millimeters set up, so I'm going to use millimeters. And in this case, let's go ahead and tr uh, fill it that curve. Um, and you can change the radius, so I'll go ahead and stick with third, uh, 15. And then you can decide if you want to trim it. So if I select no here and I fill it these two curves, you see it'll retain the original curve and it'll just add the fillet. Um, if I try that again, but I select trim yes, it will then fillet that and trim those curves. So now those are connected as one curve that's been filleted at that corner. I can also join curves. So if I, I select these two curves and type in join, that'll join all of those into one continuous curve. Um, offset is a really useful command. So type in offset. You can see under the offset options, you can change the distance. So right now I'm doing five millimeters. Um, you can also say whether you want it to offset on both sides or just one side. So if I keep it as the default, it's going to offset on just one side. If I select both sides, it'll do both sides. Um, once I click, it'll then create those offsets. Another uh, useful command is connect. So if I do another line over here, let's say, and I want to connect these two lines, I can select them both and type in connect. And it will basically extend both lines until they intersect. Um, at that point. Um, another really nice command is blend curve. So if I type in blend curve, uh, it asks me to select the curve to blend and then the second curve and it basically extends those two curves in a smooth way to create one continuous curve. And that also, these all of these work in three dimensions as well. So right now I'm drawing two dimensionally but if this was three dimensional it would create a three dimensional blended curve. Um, all of these can be found under curve, uh, right here, extend curve, fillet curve, connect curve, offset, blend curve. You'll see there's a few other options as well, but those are the um, ones that you'll use the most.